Today, October 31st, we celebrate the feast day of St. Wolfgang or Ratisbon, missionary, priest, and bishop. Wolfgang was born in Germany, and at school, he encountered Henry, a young noble who went on to become Archbishop of Trier. Meanwhile, Wolfgang remained in close contact with the Archbishop, teaching in his cathedral school and supporting his efforts to reform the clergy. At the death of the Archbishop, Wolfgang chose to become a Benedictine monk and moved to an abbey in Einsiedel, now part of Switzerland. Ordained a priest, he was appointed director of the monastery school there. Later, he was sent to Hungary as missionary, though his zeal and goodwill yielded limited results. Emperor Otto II appointed him bishop of Regensburg, near Munich. Wolfgang immediately initiated reform of the clergy and of religious life, preaching with vigor and effectiveness and always demonstrating special concern for the poor. He wore the habit of a monk and lived an austere life. The draw to monastic life never left him, including the, the desire for a life of solitude. At one point, he left his diocese so that he could devote himself to prayer, but his responsibilities as bishop called him back. In 994, Wolfgang became ill while on a journey. He died in Austria. In 1054, Pope St. Leo IX canonized St. Wolfgang as a model of the bishop who is ready to correct as well as direct the flock entrusted to him. St. Wolfgang, pray for us.